We are now at Katosa uh, Spiritual Center, and this is a place where this is a place where Adolfo Ludigo was born, and uh, it is a very holy place. We are happy to have our brother Masarek Raphael. May you please tell us how you feel after reaching on this holy land? Oh yes, it is a great honor, and the glory goes back to God the Almighty, who has led me to this place. Yeah. As it is really said that in the presence of God, all of the mountains melt like wax. I really believe something new is always added on the life of a person whenever he goes to a very holy place like this one. And for this, I'm grateful to God and uh, I have faith that uh, uh, great things have happened, have happened in my life, so I'm really grateful I'm, and uh, I'm really happy that I'm um, at Katosa uh, Holy Ground. Thank you. Uh, mm. At Katosa uh, Holy Place, and here we have our two theologians who are going to share with us how they feel after reaching on the Holy Land like this. May you please tell us your name and how you feel, uh, especially when you reach in this uh, Holy Land. Yes, yes, yes. Good morning, viewers. Uh, I'm uh, Brother Robert Tuambalo from Captain. So I have come for a pilgrimage here in the morning for like 30 minutes. I have just been praying just right over there. I have enjoyed my morning prayers. I feel uh, the inspiration of the Holy Spirit. I'm actually happy to be here. And uh, I encourage all those who are viewing me also to come to this place called Katosa. That's the home of St. Adolf. Thank you so much. This is another brother who has come to visit this place for, I don't know how many times maybe we hear from him. Let him tell us his name and how he feels after visiting this holy place. Okay. Uh, good morning, all dear Christians and all those who are following us on this media. My name is Brother Birung Thomas. I'm born of this area. I'm very grateful for this is the third time since I have come to pay a pilgrimage on this holy place. So the place is named after said Adolf, Adolf Tveyalirwa, one of our sons who was born here. But all the matters are uh, having each one a stone marked. You can see the the, the photos drawn very well, so when you come, you prostrate, you touch on the stone, you feel the grace of God. And whatever you pray for and you have the faith, you believe, really it is manifesting in your life. I have really enjoyed, and indeed we have traveled with all my brothers to pray for the order, to pray for the caption order, to pray for our brothers, and we have traveled with our media team. Us as the media team, we have come to broadcast and we see the marvels which happen with the Uganda matters. I think the cameraman is showing you, you can see St. Gonzaga, St. Kizitu is there, another St. Javira Msoki is down there. So we're really very happy next time when you feel you want to pray for your family, you're most welcome to Port Porto. Thank you.